Hi guys, this is my unboxing and review of the Otterbox Symmetry Hybrid case for the iPad Pro 9.7. After the fastidious job of putting in a screen protector, a tempered glass screen protector on the iPad Pro, now it's time to protect it with a good case. So after an extensive research I made online, I found out that this case is one of the best cases for the iPad Pro. It usually exists in uh, the 9.7 format, which is this one and the 12.9 format which is this huge format you know so uh, let's uh, open this even the box has a magnetic closure over here which is usually a good sign of quality What's remarkable about this case, first it's the quality, you know, as soon as you hold the case you see that it's made of very very high quality material, okay? The material is a polycarbonate synthetic rubber and nylon, but it is scratch resistant, okay? And it comes in two parts, there is the cover, which is, uh, protects your screen mainly, it has a very soft... Uh, feeling on the inside and a very leathery uh, protective uh, feeling on the outside okay and the back part of the case is clear okay so uh, it shows your uh, iPad Pro and you know the elegant lines of your iPad Pro uh, there's a label over here clear protection or in French protection transparent uh, there is a cutout for the camera and the flash okay the camera sensor and the flash uh, and there's a holder over here for your uh, apple pencil okay which is something really uh, useful because the apple pencil is a very costly uh, accessory and you surely don't want to lose it okay so the reason why this case comes in two parts is uh, as you know the iPad Pro, uh, whether it is the 9.7 or the 12.9 uh, version, has a, a three dot connector over here uh, that enables the tablet to connect to um, a keyboard or, or you know, compatible accessory. Okay, so this case being in two parts, let's say if you install only this part of the case then you will have the connector exposed which means it will protect the back of the tablet and you will have the, con the connector exposed so you can uh, connect it to the keyboard or you know to the accessory if you don't have the accessory or you just need full protection of the tablet okay so like I do I don't need really a keyboard for this tablet I use my computer for my uh, you know regular tasks uh, the tablets only for multimedia consumption so I don't really need a, uh, a keyboard for it which means I need a uh, full protection so in my case uh, I will need to uh, mount the tablet you know the two parts of the tablet uh, by pressing on the three uh, hinges over here if I can call them you know so the hinges will make like a click sound, I don't know if you can hear it, here you go, and the second one is already in, the third one is already in, okay, so now I need to remove the label of course, 
and it's something remarkable you know you remove the label it doesn't leave any residue on the back cover of the tablet which is important because you need it to be as clean and neat as possible you know you have to check it with the camera position to be sure to put it in the correct place okay you start by pressing on one side and then You make sure that the tablet is really well seated in, in the case from all the you know all the, the sides. It's good to know that uh, the tempered glass uh, screen protector is on the edges of the inner part of the case. Uh, the screen protector is not damaged and it's still in place. Okay, so this is something interesting to notice. You know the snug fit is a good sign because your uh, your tablet will be secured in the case and it's not gonna fall uh, anytime soon. So now the case is installed. Thank God. It took uh, a while, you know. You know, first remarks about this case. I can tell you that it's really sturdy. You know, you feel it. It's solid in your hands, and uh, the feeling is really nice. You know, it's well made. It's something good. Uh, let me put uh, the pencil, the Apple pencil, so you can see how the holder works. You just slide it in. You slide it in like this. It's really easy. There you go. The Apple pencil is in, in its place. Okay. Very practical. And it has the, you know, uh, auto wake sleep function. So whenever you open the case, the tablet uh, wakes up. And whenever you close the case, the tablet uh, goes back to, let's say, standby mode. Okay. And uh, it has uh, like uh, linings over here. So you can put your tablet. You can use it like uh, the case as a stand too. If you want to watch movies, multimedia, whatever, you know. And the second position is like this. This is good for, you know, typing uh, with your uh, on-screen keyboard, okay? And uh, to use the tablet, uh, you know, in tablet mode, you just open the case. And uh, flip the cover to the back. This way you can use it one-handed, you know, in tablet mode. Uh, the cover doesn't have, doesn't stick to the back of the tablet. It doesn't have a magnet, you know, but it's light and it won't flip around while you're using it uh, in tablet mode. It's really like, now I'm using it one-handed and you can see that uh, it doesn't move that much in the back front cover that is now on the back of the tablet is light all right since you already know the ipad pro has uh, four speakers uh, whether it is the 12.9 or the 9.7 version it has uh, four speakers you know two on the top and two on the bottom okay so you in the case you have cutouts for the speakers on both sides of the tablet okay and uh, in the back it's really really nice i like the you know the the cutout for the camera it's really stylish and uh, i like the way it shows the back of the tablet you know it's really nice and uh, this case you know has a good opening for uh, the lightning port and uh, the wide opening for the lightning port enables you to charge your tablet without any problem and it has also an opening over here for uh, the headphone jack okay it's really wide so uh, i guess you won't have also any problem to use your uh, wired headphones and uh, plug them in this jack and uh, the case has openings for uh, the, mic the microphone over here 
I don't know if you can see it well. It's next to the volume rockers, okay. And it has another opening for a microphone next to the camera sensor, okay. And the flash. And what I like about this case is that the volume rockers are covered, they are protected, okay. And uh, the power button too, as you can see in here. It's also covered so the case is very functional and very protective at the same time and being stylish too so I guess it's the perfect case for the iPad Pro in my opinion and um, that's it uh, this is the you know the upper box symmetry case for the iPad Pro 9.7 as I already mentioned it also comes in 12.9 inches version, which is huge, you know, the same uh, magnetic box. And the case is huge, if you compare, you know, both. it's the very, very same case with the two parts, uh, you, know, uh, the, you know, the clear back, uh, the very, very same. And you still have the you know the stylus uh, holder over here. Uh, this case sells for almost a hundred US dollars or 130 Canadian dollars here in Canada. You can get it for maybe a little, a little bit uh, less money if you go online now. That it's been out for a while now, so the prices went down. Uh, I really recommend this case if you want a good case for your iPad Pro, whether it is the 9.7 or the 12.9. I recommend the Otterbox Symmetry uh, hybrid case, okay? Because uh, it's at the same time stylish, okay? It's not very thick, it's not like the Otterbox Defender, okay, which is really huge, and uh, it gives good protection for your tablet. It's practical at the same time, you have a place for your S Pen, uh, I really advise you to get this case, so you will be happy with it uh, for your iPad Pro. Okay, so this was my review of the Otterbox Symmetry Hybrid case for the iPad Pro 9.7 and 12.9. Thank you very much, I hope you liked my video, don't forget to uh, subscribe and hit the like button, okay, thanks, bye.